to the Ninth Underworld, the land of eternal rest, in four minutes instead of four years. But very few people qualify. Let's take... Bad news is the train appears to be just out of your reach, but I still got a couple of tricks up my sleeve here. Mm-hmm. Yeah ha! Yes, that's the ticket. The Excelsior line. Yes, she's a beauty. That compass in the handle will uh -huh. sure come in handy, too. Excelsior. Oh, you're going to have a great trip. Wish I was going. Why don't you? You could give me a lift. Oh, I can't leave here until I've worked off a little debt to the powers that be. Community service, eh? Well, I guess there are some folks worse off than me. Oh, I'll be leaving here soon enough! No thanks to dead and no commission low-life cases like yours, Menso. Hey, Manny. The boss told me to tell you not to leave early tonight. He wants to talk to you about something when he gets back from his trip. Tell Don not to worry. I'm not going anywhere. Especially not with clients like that. Where do they get these guys? They don't qualify for anything good, so I can't sell anything good. I can't work off my time, and I'm stuck. Stuck selling walking sticks to a bunch of burros for eternity. I need better clients. I need a real saint. I need a lead on a rich, dead saint. ¿Qué es esto? So yeah, welcome to Grim Fandango. Um, I'm actually gonna check that it's like. We can do tank controls because there's an achievement with that. And like I want that achievement so bad. Well, since so, that doesn't feel so bad. It's some sort of special work order. To all agents from office manager Don Copel. All right, you boneheads. Thank you, lucky stars, and get to your friggin' cars. We have a mass poisoning on our hands. Too many dead to assign specific cases, so all clients are first come, first serve. So let's see some hustle out there. Whatever you say, Hiffy. So Dawn actually reminds me of John Jonah Jameson. Like JJJ from the Spidey Universe. And yes, I'm using the tank controls. Here's Celso's file. That walking stick was too good for him. Better take these cards. It looks like a long day of solitaire for me. And here's the beautiful part. It's some sort of special work order. Oh yeah, that's the poisoning, but... We need to get a card. We know that, or 
I do. Let's talk to a beautiful secretary who isn't our secretary. Buenos dias. Eva. Manny, why aren't you at the poisoning? What poisoning? The code three gazpacho poisoning that everybody's at but you. Why do I send out memos if nobody reads them? Well, that's why I don't eat tomato soup. Especially not the cold kind. Where was the poisoning again? Just ask your driver for crying out loud. He'll know. Uh, I forget. Am I supposed to be somewhere right now? Manny, do I have to explain your job to you again? Yes, my dear lady. Of course you do. Because, uh, Madame Rouge shut them. Yes. Well, the Manuel Calavera that I know picks up people in the land of the living. Dead people? Preferably. And he brings them here and tries valiantly to sell them the best travel package they qualify for. If he sells them enough premium packages, our hero will be free to leave the land of the dead. Until then, he and I are stuck here having the same conversation over and over again for eternity. Sounds like my job as a cashier, but... Yeah. Yeah, no. Nice to know. Well, enough know. about me. What's your job like? Like babysitting. Except I don't get to watch TV. Still sounds like a cashier's job. What if we just skip town tonight? You and me, baby. Well, thanks for the offer, but we'd never make it out of the city alive. But... In one piece, I mean. I bet I could get you out. If I really tried. Oh, Manny, look at you. You're a trap soul and you don't even know it. Why do some clients qualify for better travel packages? They led good lives. Que tries. How do you define a good life? Better than yours and mine. And if you choose this option, you would actually get an achievement called What I did back in the fat days is none of your patience business, you know. So what did you do in life to get stuck here? What I did back in the fat days is none of your business. You know the rules. And I actually um, named the, um, the stream after that because I remember like the first time I heard that I thought that was pretty funny like Um, I wore braces and I would usually say like the people who knew me <laughs> after I wore braces would like it's better if you don't know what happened to me before I wore braces and when I wore braces, like I I came out, so <laughs> there was a dark, dark past to that. Like bisexuality even though it was a thing just one more like, question about my job it man was you know what to do stop playing dumb just to flirt with me it was still be like causing any messages for me besides the one about the poisoning stuff. yeah i only have one other message for you manny i'm not your secretary i don't take your messages so get it through your thick skull and stop forwarding your phone to me all right but that sounded more like four messages to me In my heart, though, you're still my secretary. Manny, what are you talking about? I was never your secretary, even when you were on top. I got one boss, same as you, Don Copel. But in my heart, you're still my secretary, even though you say... Don 
Come on, on I know boss. you work for another man besides Don. What? Well, what are you talking about? I know you take memos for Hurley sometimes. Ah, oh, Manny, just beat it, will ya? Busy as ever, I see. I'd have more work to do if you had more clients. Ouch. Where is everybody? Oh, Manny, did you forget what day it is today? Oh, man, did I come in on Saturday again? It's the Day of the Dead. Everybody's back in the land of the living, visiting their families like we should be. Well, would Manny just say, like, he came in on a Saturday again? I have tried that when I worked in, uh... Cosmetic store called Matas or Matas, uh, where I actually came in on a first day and it was my day off. But my boss hadn't told me that I had a weekly day off on Thursday, so I met at work. Fresh as a fuck face. And <laughs> my boss would actually tell me that it was my day off. Boy! Was I Why aren't you off? visiting your family today? Ah, the boss is here, so I gotta be here. How about you, Cal? No one back there I wanna see. And you don't want Domino here alone, getting all the good leads. Domino's here? He's at the poisoning right now, stealing your commission. So? You going to the Christmas party? After the spectacle you made of yourself last year? I wouldn't miss it for the world. Any good gossip? Well, I heard Domino got a raise. Por favor, tell me some good news, why don't you? I still love you. You're all I really need, belleza. Manny, if you don't mind, I've got a lot of filing here to do. Right, I do watch you. Even though I don't got a secretary, I got like this really cute romance with uh, one of my co-workers and whenever I'm in the Reggie, like... Making sure all your customers get your consumables or like your groceries. He asked me if I need a cup of coffee, but unlike Eva, he's actually nice. Where I would be that Maybe card trick some other time when I'm not so Maybe busy. card trick some other time when I'm not so busy. So this one leads down to Glorus. Like the if you ever played the game before. Like, you know who Glorus is. Uh, <laughs> sorry. You know who Glorus is. Um, so, I don't need to get the Robert Frost, um, or the Kitty, or the Dingo. Um, what the fuck is up with my British action, accent today? Like... I guess it's because I'm tired. <laughs> like, I become like somewhat British because my dad is British Irish, like my bio dad, but I live with my mom, so. By the way, I have to live the, with the tank controls. Like, as a kid, that would be 100% A-OK, -okay, but now, 23 years old, on a, ex on a 
I was close to say on an Xbox 4, but you know, like a PS4. Hey, what's going down, That's clown? That's not a okay. bank off suit. I'm practicing. Practicing what? Ring in your neck. What does it look like? Twist me up one of them, huh, fella? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Twist this, all right? So whoever is watching, thank you so much. You can do a cat. Shows what you know, buddy. I can do anything. I can do birds, amphibians, famous poets. Go ahead. Name one. So, here's one. A famous dead poet is actually Robert Frost. And I think I like read one of his poets. And here's the fucking embarrassing one. I can't remember what poem of Robert Frost I read, but I know one of his. A dead worm. Heck, that's easy. But yeah, what you need is two dead worms, because... There's no limit on those. Got it tell straight right now. That's a lie, because... When you get to the pigeon toss, no balloons are for. Once you, uh, once you use, no balloons are for. That's no balloons are for. Oh, sorry. <laughs> I forgot I had one. Like, you need Robert Frost and you need two dead worms. Because of Robert Frost, here's the funny one. You can actually use Robert Frost to get an achievement called. Oh, what's it called? Uh, Run Pigeons is Robert Frost, where you actually try to intimidate, like, the pigeons with. Him. The Robert Frost. Yeah. With My the kingdom, Robert Frost. Another balloon uh, animal. jeez. Uh, what now? Balloon animal. Robert Frost, trying to stop me, eh? And you also get one for lousy bony fingers, like. You want to get the balloon twister to Some actually of my finest work, don't you think, Sparky? <laughs> Sorry. Like you wanna scare him. Some festival, huh? Yeah, yeah, pretty So busy. he pops one of his really balloons and then you, you got lousy yeah. bony fingers. You don't have a tongue, but that doesn't seem to shut you up now, does it? Walk through your tent. I want to see the parade. Well, walk through and someone else's tent, all right? Do I look me. like a turnstile to you? Yet. Yeah. Bang. Bang. Ah. Popped another one. Lousy bony fingers. When you get the bang, like you have my to kid with uh, wants another balloon animal. Ah, jeez. What I now? Got one dead worm, I got one Robin Frost, right? Right. Do you have any more dead worms back there? Well, sure. I'm gonna do like a speedy one right here because I got all achievements until we get to... Until we get to... It's not like I'm... It's not like I'm not happy on this. I'm leaving the thick black nauseating fumes. 
like, I mean, I don't have that one. <laughs> and I surely don't have the... Uh... The marrow of these trees, many. They suck it out. It's like... Immense. I, I... I don't have that one either. And thank you so much. That one who is watching. Write your name in the comments. <laughs> and... You get a shout out. For reals, because I wanna know who you are. Because you're awesome. Yeah. So yeah. I want to put the dead worm inside my um, suit. And that's because a dead worm can open a door. And... If I'm walking like an idiot, it's because on the PS4 I'm not used to the tank controls. I played this on PC. And yeah, I did that in like the 90s. Because I'm in early 90s. Baby. Like 93. I wanna say I'm that young, but still, I wanna say I'm that old. Because if you remember Doom, like the first one that came out in December 1993, in December, I was born in July that year. So, I'm older than fucking Doom. Like, some month. Not when there's a door. Hey, service! Hey, who the? For people who don't know, that's gone. Oh, sorry, sir. I didn't expect... Sales agents usually don't come over to this part of the garage. So, a sales assistant, a sales agent, and... a cashier is basically the fucking same thing. Nice hut. Yeah, I wonder how nice it would seem to you if you were trapped in it all day like me. If you hate your job, why don't you quit? It's not just a job. It's what I was created to do. If I get any farther away from cars than this, I'll get sick and die. It's like I'm not happy unless I'm breathing in the thick, black, nauseating fumes. Hmm, can't imagine. Hey, you a driver? Me? Ha! No, 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 no. I don't ride them, just wrench them. I'm Calavera, Manny Calavera. My name's Gladys. I don't get many visitors. Hey, I got a message for a Mr. Calavera. Uh, your driver said that Mr. Hurley said that he could have the rest of the day off. Domino sent my driver home? Yeah, wasn't that nice? Gladys? Gladys? Is that a German name? Oh, no. My roots lie not in any earthly nation's soil. I am an elemental spirit summoned up from the land of the dead itself and given one purpose, one skill, one desire... to drive! Or to change oil and adjust timing belts if no driving jobs are open. 
looks like I need a new driver. Oh! I, uh, I, uh, I would agree with that. Yes, you do. You want to be my replacement driver? Me? Oh, oh, no. Sorry. Can't. Rules. Come on, Gladys. I need you to be my driver. No, I can't. I'm... I'm... I'm too big. No, you're not. Let me tell you something. The cars are just too small. You're not too big. The cars are just too small. Yeah, those dang compact cars. Hey, that gives me an idea. I could alter your car just a bit with just a quick torch job to let out the seams, you know? I'll, but I'm not allowed to modify the cars without a work order from upstairs. I could lose my job. A work order, huh? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I can't torch anything bigger than a cigarette without one of these signed by the boss himself. Hey, hey, hey. that's my line. Getting people to sign. Back in a snap. Yeah, too small. I'm not too big. Everything around here is just too small. Claudius, I knew you me. And I actually got that trophy. <laughs> and... For people who just joined in... Thank you. Um, so, I'm using... The old tank controls just to get an achievement. So, how are you peeps doing today? Or tonight on vote night? So yeah, you also get an achievement for the whole punch. If I really need- I'll give it a shot. Mr. Copel, I've got Manny Calavera out here to see you. Didn't I say no interruptions today? Eh, sorry, Cal. Maybe tomorrow. That's too late. Oh yeah, like you're going anywhere. Like this one. Mind if I use your hole punch? Knock yourself out. If you get an achievement for doing that. Thanks. Gets the aggressions out, doesn't it? Here's Celso's file. That walking stick was too good for him. So that transportation part is like where you need to use your dead worms. 
later on. Sorry, I have no face cam on because I If I should have my face cam on <laughs> like Buy one I would of love to search the fuck faces. That would be like seven point five times one one of your American dollars. It looks like Don's rigged his computer to automatically answer his intercom. Oh, cripes, Eva. Just sign it yourself, will ya? I'm busy. Even though. What I what I chose, even though I know it's wrong, I chose this one because I just wanted to hear what Eva would say. Because as a sales assistant or sales accountant or anything. Doing with sales, you actually feel like when you got those uh, you got a certain kind of customers where you just want to throw yourself out of the window. I'll just change his auto response here. Ah, oh, cripe, Zeba! Just sign it yourself, will you? I'm busy! Nice to know, boss.
fucking hate tank controls. Sorry the silence, but yeah, you know. If I really need the boss to sign this work order, I'll give it a shot. Mr. Copel, Mr. Calavera has something out here that he says he needs your signature on. Ah, oh, great, Ava, just sign it yourself, will you? I'm busy. You'll have to excuse him, Manny. It's probably a really hard crosswood puzzle he's got in there today. Eva, I'm impressed. I had no idea you had this kind of power. Well, we all have our secrets. Say black is slimming. I'm driving, yeah! I'm driving! <laughs> <laughs> You will pop an achievement if <laughs> you scare a few of the living, actually, so...
nice bathroom. That's not a bathroom, you dipshit. But we offer several travel package upgrades if you care to cut the yap. I want something cheap where I can get some rest, and that's it. Ay, ay, ay. You know, Manny, I could make this car a little faster if you wanted. Yeah, yeah. Whatever. Oh, yeah. Slam the front into the weeds. Tub the rear end. Two blowers popping out of the hood. You'll get plenty you know, of rest this way, Mr. Martinez. Clotters. Safely padded Actually by the foam created with two chemicals mixed like this. Oh, on second thought, I want to upgrade my package. Sorry, Bruno, but you didn't qualify for anything better. But here, have this complimentary mug. No, wait! Uh, can't you find me something where I can move my legs? You know I'd like to, Bruno. But my boss is a real hard ass. I gotta be a hard ass when I got lazy sickle waivers like this jolly boy working for me. Manny, you couldn't find a sale at a yacht club. I got a sale right here. I'm talking premium sales, Calavera. Like the kind Domino makes. How am I supposed to make premium sales with the scumbag clients you're sending me? Hey! Now you're blaming the clients? I've had it with you, Manny. If you haven't bagged a premium before the next sales report comes in, you're out! Out on the street! No job! No way to work off your time! Just your fancy suit and your big smile and a whole lot of time to kill! Who you calling a scumbag? Why well, I oughta... <sighs> I'm sick of waiting around for a good lead. Like it's gonna fly in here tied to a brick? It's time to take one. So... I'll be back in a short while. I have to take a whiz. And to put it in perspective, like in Denmark, it's like six minutes to six in the morning. And it's cold as shit.
I'm back. Sorry the long, long wait for me, like, getting to pee and, like, turning on a scented candle and getting my socks on to actually keep the heat. But yeah, don't we all got a boss who's an hot ass? Like, seriously? I know, I got. But yeah. Unlike my. <laughs> Unlike Manny, I actually excuse my boss. Like. He's being a hot ass because he needs Manny, to. Manny, what are you doing? Just marking cards, honey. Whatever floats your boat. So as you see, Don's office is now open. Open. Like. That's a new thing, right? So yeah, I'm like... When we... When we reach, like... Around like... <laughs> 11 o'clock... My time... I have been awake for like 24 hours. I don't feel like pitching cards right now. This card's full of holes. Well, at least you're not hitting the bottle anymore. Hey, Callie, how you doing? So, how'd you make out of the poisoning? Well, let's just say that Sister Calabaza has a secret passion. For trains. You got a nun? Hail Mary. And you sold her a ticket on the number nine train. Choo choo, little buddy. Say, how'd you score? I got a nun too. Bruno's a pretty strange name for a nun, wouldn't you say? Well, you know how cruel sisters can be about nicknames. So, I actually want to notice, like, If you didn't, like... The sweat marks on Domino's back actually looks like a tie. <laughs> like... He's a working man, but... His sweat marks on the front is actually showing a skull. Or a vulture. So he's not working that hard at all. I want to punch you in the mouth. Oh no, not the Christmas party all over again. I want to ask you a question. Shoot, slugger. Is it hard to kiss up to the boss so much when you got no lips? Hey, I got all the lip I need. I get it from you. Can I have one of your clients? Sure, Cal. Just as soon as I get one I think you could handle. I can handle anything you got, especially if that's your best right jab. Why do you get all the good clients? You're asking the wrong guy. You should be taking a good long look at the man in the mirror. No thanks. I don't enjoy that the same way you do. What did you do to get this job? You mean, what's my secret to success? No, I mean, how did you screw up and get stuck here at the DOD? What sin did you commit and how long are you gonna have to work here to pay it off? Well, I could easily ask the same question of you, but I don't know the answer. I still don't know what I've done. Well, how convenient. Then, uh, neither do I. Except yet, though. I wanna tell you something. Good. Go on and let it all out, Manny. There's no reason for you to be afraid of me. 
You know, this used to be my office. Yeah, I know. I found your name on some comic books in the desk. I want my office back. Don't worry, you'll have years and years to enjoy it after I get promoted out and you're still here. Spoiler alert, except you don't. I think you're up to something. Yeah, I'm up to about four premium sales this week. <laughs> I think we should team up, be partners. Oh, Manny, I, I would, but I'm too intimidated. I could never be partners with someone who was so much more of a man than me. Oh, come on. I've seen your wife. <laughs> what happened at the Christmas party? Blacked out on the whole thing, huh? Maybe you should switch to lemonade, kid. Well, you sound pretty out of breath, so I'm gonna blow. Always a pleasure, Cal. suits and your nose holes way up in the air, sticking your empty beer bottles down the message tubes. How fancy is that? Huh? Don't you boys upstairs realize the tube switcher is a sophisticated and delicate piece of machinery? Huh? You think you're better than me? No. Good. <laughs> Look 
Pika below. Server's down again. What else is new? compelling. Joint sky high? That's a magnesium compound fire extinguisher. Spray that on this packing foam, and we'll both be riding the giant Roman candle out of here. What? Why would they put something so dangerous in here? I guess they didn't expect this room to be full of hazardous waste. Mercedes Colomar, I think you're the one for me. Gladys, are you loco? What got into you? That was a company car. Oh, yeah. And it's even better company now. I'm in. You're not the nurse? No. You're not here to give me my medication? No, but I am here to ease your pain. Guess they couldn't save me, huh? No, but there's still a chance you could save me. That's a lot of responsibility, Mr. Calavera. What makes you think I've been all that good? Miss Colomar. Meche, please. Meche, 
I can see it in your face and in your file here, where it says you're entitled to a first-class ticket to... Nowhere? What? Did I do something wrong? Not according to your bio. It was spotless. At least the part I read was. I'm not sure I like the implication, Mr. Calavera. Excuse me, but I have to go straighten this mess out. Sorry to be so much trouble, Mr. Calavera. It's no trouble, but please. So we got to Michi, which means that I'm gonna stop it here just to get some sleep. I'm sorry guys, and girls, but you know, it's real.